270 pounds, Tammy, a 40-year-old loggerhead, was taking one of her last meals in the tank at Sea Turtle Recovery. Squid, shrimp, and crab were all on the menu. She looks a lot different from when she first arrived a year ago. She had over 38 pounds of barnacles, mussels, and mud on her back. She was brought to Sea Turtle Recovery after picked up by a Coast Guard cutter in Delaware Bay. She was floating, unable to dive. When cleaned up, Bill Deere says they found six propeller cuts on her back. Those cuts exposed bone, uh, which were mostly healed when we found her, but she still had some internal infections, so we had to treat her with antibiotics for several months. The pieces that make up a turtle's outer shell, called scoots, also had to regrow. Since then, she's gained 55 pounds and is very active. That means she's ready to go, and we're so excited to, to see that. So next week, we'll pack her up and take her on a 55-minute ride down the parkway. From the Water Street entrance to the beach in Point Pleasant, she'll be sent back into the ocean with three other turtles called Kemp's Ridley, which also have been rehabbed from injury. And they expect all four to thrive once back in the wild. As soon as we get down to the beach and they smell that salt air and they hear the waves, you definitely see their attitude uh, perk up.